A lot still needs to be done to reduce the rate of out-of-school children in Nigeria. Now, the Human Development Initiatives has underscored the place of Parents Forum in Lagos to achieve effective education. Details in this report. The federal government says Nigeria's out-of-school children has dropped to 6.946 million from 10.1 million. To sensitize parents on this issue and keep these young children in school, the Human Development Initiative feels it is imperative to sensitize the parents on what is expected of them. Even with this pandemic, there are lots of out-of-school children. So, and um, we believe that the home is the foundation of everything, even including education. And these children, they grow, uh, they come out from their home into the streets or whatever they have to do. So um, this parents forum, they are representative in different schools. Without inclusive and equitable quality education and lifelong opportunities for all, Nigeria will not succeed in breaking the cycle of poverty, which has left millions of children behind. So in the wake of the World Education Day, which focuses on recovering and revitalizing education for the COVID-19 generation, stakeholders say now is the time to step up collaboration to place education at the center of the recovery. Parents have the duty to ensure that their children are enrolled in schools. The same applies to even guardians. So it's very critical for people to realize that any parent that fails to do due diligence to enroll their children or even wards in school, they have um, contravened the law. So for the parents, it will no longer be business as usual as they speak of charting a new path. I'm going to support to the fullest of my ability the, uh, the Lagos State uh, leave no child behind. I'm going to reduce the number that we've uh, been told here that uh, more than 50 million children are out of school. Before the resolution, we have, we parents, we have came together to buy uh, wash, wash hand basin, then towel, sanitizer, and soap. So for the children to be able, before they can enter the class, they will wash their hand. Less than 40% of girls in sub-Saharan Africa complete lower secondary school, and some 4 million children and youth refugees are out of school. The right to education of many is being violated, and it is time to change the narrative. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.